We're back. College football action in the Metro tonight. We start with a local rivalry, Bellhaven, hosting Millsaps in the Riverside Rumble. Let's see how this year's battle turned out. Blaine McCorkle and the Bellhaven Blazers at home this year for the Riverside Rumble. New Millsaps head coach Isaac Carter making his debut in this showdown 14-7 game in the first quarter in favor of Bellhaven. They increased their lead as Mayawa Asagula hits Brookers Brimer on the play action pass. That's a touchdown. The Blazers with a two score lead, leading 21 to seven in the first. The home fans loving it and they'll love this highlight. Senior running back Brad Foley breaks for an 18 yard run in the second quarter. And with that run, he becomes the career rushing leader for Bellhaven with over 2,000 career yards. His mom was at the game and got the record setting ball. More Foley this time. He adds to his rushing record with a short four yard touchdown run that gives the Blazers a 28 to seven lead. The Blazers just too hot tonight. They beat Millsaps 56-28. It's the first Riverside Rumble win in the Blaine McCorkle era. And the Blazers have won four straight, dating back from the spring. All right, now to Mississippi College head coach John Bland, John Bland and the Mississippi College Shot Calls opening their season at home on Thursday night against the Golden Rams of Albany State out of the SAG Conference. Shot tall great Mississippi Swartz Hall of Famer and Saints Hall of Famer. Fred McAfee in the house for tonight's game, trying to pump up his old team. MC trying to get something done early on, down seven to nothing. Deontay Smith Moore with the keeper picks up the first down, but the drive would fizzle out. On the other side, Deontay Banu at the controls. The protection breaks down for him, but he Finds an opening and bolts for an 18-yard first down run. Same drive. Bono drops back, hits Rashad Jordan, the freshman, and he does the rest. Jordan is gone. He goes up the far sideline for a 74-yard touchdown. Albany State will lead 14-0 at halftime. The Shock Tars, they fall in their opening 24-0. 